but I'm here in London this week with Chris. Hi guys, how you doing? So we want to talk about rugby scholarships. Chris, you're a rugby player, obviously, because yeah. you're massive. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, Glad to think so. So Chris, who are you? Let's tell, you, tell yourself, uh, tell the audience who yeah, you are. Yeah, so uh, I've been playing rugby all my life. Uh, kind of started up uh, in Worcestershire, West Midlands here. Started off at Starbridge. Uh, went then on to Worcester Warriors Academy. Um, played obviously school level, college level, uh, Charlton College. Uh, won the David Mel Cup at 16. Um, then obviously, Christmas, that's good. yeah, it was great to be involved in that at early age. Um, got spotted, went to Jersey with family. Uh, played for JRSC Academy, um, and then moved on to several sevens tournaments. Um, and then obviously played in uh, South Sydney as well. So looking to extend that and go play in the US and hopefully teach them a little bit about. What, what the game's like in Europe. He's going to kind of show some English muscle. Yeah, hopefully, mate. <laughs> I do us proud. Yeah. So, obviously, you've come to Cater with the recruiting process in the US you know, a bit late because you're 20 how old 24 now. 24 yeah. now. So, you're not going to yeah. be going to like the Division 1 level for the age range, yeah. right? Yeah. But, um, what, what made you interested to go to the US? What's changed you know, for you? What was the side effect? I want to go see what America's like. Yeah, sure. So, uh, I actually went over in 2015 uh -huh. um, to Arizona, to Phoenix, to ASU. And I saw their rugby program, and although it was quite, you know, in the early stages of it, it was it was the enthusiasm really and the college life that got me driven to contact you guys and yeah. to, to to really get myself over there. Um, long time I want to be in the US anyway um, for several reasons, but weather, rugby wise and weather. the weather's weather's one of them. Although yeah. the pick you in England, it's actually really sunny out here now, so <laughs> it's not it's not that bad. <laughs> no comparison, mate. No comparison. It was raining yesterday. Raining like, yesterday, and the other, yeah, during fifty nine days. Um, but no, it really is the college experience. Rugby for me out there is is um, uh, a very new thing, really, especially at college level. And yeah. they're really, in my opinion, heavily investing in it. Um, I actually coach a little bit at ASU, and they're really investing in in, in their rugby program. Um, obviously, there's a new rugby league. Uh, coming out in the States this year. Yeah. And is that, fashion, is that where fashion. you want to be? You want to, you want to go to college and ideally go to the... To the yeah, league? I think so. Um, yeah. You know, I'll always have professional um, um, kind of ambitions anyway, uh, business-wise. But for me, personally, I would love having played, um, you know, a little bit uh, over here, semi-pro, but without being paid. It would uh, be a great thing for me to go and, you know, experience what they've got in the professional league and hopefully add to it and uh, help me create a good, good establishment. And yeah. I think it can follow on nicely from, from college. Yeah, yeah. Um, awesome, man. So, obviously, we only, we've only known you from, what, March time, March, right? So, yeah. you know, it wasn't like we'd known each other. You found us through Google. Have to... Actually, it's funny enough to say that. It was, I've got a friend at um, University of Texas, who's at, um, touch my cousin, second cousin, and he's a uh, golf athlete as well. Oh, yeah? And he said to, uh, he went through a sports recruitment agency, and, I actually went on to Google then and it was yeah. uh, top hit, so uh, it was his recommendation and yeah. then we found you guys for them. Yeah. I, mean, I mean, obviously, we, we've been chatting before this, but you know, we're sharing stories and when I did this process, I had very limited choices, right? Because I didn't know what I was doing, I had no health guidance. You've had the opposite, you've had the whole friggin' team. Absolutely. How have you yeah. found the experience so far working with us? Fantastic, actually. Yeah, uh, a lot, a lot easier than I than I initially thought it would be. Um, I actually tried doing it myself uh, last year, and it's it, tough, it was it was it's just tough, too man. impossible. And you know what? Within four days, I was speaking to the head coach of, of uh, Grand Canyon University. When you signed up with us, right? When I signed up with you guys, and uh, you know, within three four days, speaking to him on the phone, WhatsApp, and uh, you know, things were just it spiraled from there, and we've got things sorted. Spoke to admissions. And you know, I have to say, I think USA guys uh, have been phenomenal. You know, so efficient in in everything I asked them. You know, an hour response. Time, I, I told you, if they don't get on it, I'm on them. So it's Come on, man. exactly, exactly. Get our athletes sorted out. Exactly, you know, they've got, they got to help you it's out. Disappointing, and it's awesome. it's been a great process actually, and, and far yeah. easier than trying to do it by itself. What were the some? Because obviously, we, we were speaking. I remember we were working together when, when you joined the program. Yeah. Um, what were some of the things that were maybe holding you back? Yeah, maybe some athletes are watching, like, should I do this, should I not do this? What were yeah. some things that um, you were maybe uncertain of, but now you've been through the process, you're like, oh, that's not what it is. Yeah. Exactly. I think it's, for me, it was the uh, trust, I think, in you guys. Yeah. Um, before I was going a little bit blind into, into college life, I didn't know, apart from the main universities that you know us Brits hear of traditionally. Yeah, yeah. Um, I didn't know the second tier colleges, which actually offer some of the best rugby. Yeah. 
yeah. I had no idea. So it was the trust factor, I think, in yeah. you guys and the, the process. Um, l- you know, leaving it to experienced people as opposed to trying to do it myself. Um, I knew I always wanted to do it anyway um, to get to the states in some some form, and it was it was the trust and the uh, experience that I, I got from the guys at Athens we say that that um, spurred me to do it and you know ultimately uh, landed in my decision to go. So you've been through the process now, you've got a school you've committed to right? Yeah. Where you yeah. committed to? Grand Canyon University. Okay, so you're just in the application process now. Sure. So yeah. maybe a couple more weeks before couple it's more weeks. official. Yeah. What's yeah. excited? I'm very excited, yeah. Cool, you know, right. actually uh, as I said before, I've been in touch with some guys, uh, uh, one guy who's up from Stavridge, my hometown, and he's uh, off the Grand Canyon as well. He's one of our athletes. Uh, he's one of your athletes, yeah. Number eight, so 9 8 partnership access yeah, yeah, yeah. can work pretty well at the back of the scrum. So you're going to together, is that the plan? That's or? the plan, mate, yeah, and yeah. that's all for you guys as well. Cool, mate. <laughs> that's all. Um, and, you know, a bit of initiative there from your guys, and yeah. we're now rooming together, so it's fantastic. So it's above and beyond, I think. You know, just because he's going to college, he's not going to buy it, right? But we're based in the States, you know, we, I've got your the number, you've got my number, you've got the team. Yeah. They're going to keep in touch with us. Chris is going to work with us. We're going to, we want to help you go pro out there, right? Yeah. We've got an agency we work with in the US, rugby. We've got different ones, different sports. Yesterday, I was meeting Chubby for golf. So I'm you know, connecting with all these extra parties. So when you get to that point, you want to turn pro? I'm going to put you the right people in the US to make it happen. Be fantastic. You still got to deliver the goods though, man. Oh, 100%. 100%. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Miracles happen. No, too right. I can just help open right. doors for you, man. Yeah. <laughs> but I think that's, that was another, you know, extremely ben- beneficial factor for me yeah. was uh, for the longevity of my, my time in the States, yeah. it was the um, uh, you saying when I first spoke to you, actually, we can help you uh, remain in the States, yeah. remain the best post for me. And whether that's through sport and put you in touch with professional agencies yeah. as well. It, it was that, really, that sold me. But this, is, um, this is the reason why I've done that is because when I went, I had no support, right? And I realized the benefit of having a support structure there to help you after. And a lot of agencies that I call the amateur agencies, right? They go out there, they come back, create an agency, and they just get you to the stakes and that's it, right? At first, their contacts are very slim, right? I focus every day in my team to grow our network, but also not just to grow a college network, to grow a professional contact. This is why I'm back in London. I'm actually recruiting with agencies now to help find more professional deals. Sure. Yeah. So, you know, like, you know, you're going about to go to the US an amazing time, but why not try to continue that? Exactly. Right? And that's yeah. why I'm going to be able to help you now because you're working with us. You're know, exactly. taking this professionally seriously. Yeah. You've, got, you've got a whole team yeah. behind you. You're not yeah. paying them every month. Exactly. It's ama- <laughs> it is phenomenal. You should write me another check. Yeah, actually. <laughs> 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 Mate, I'm happy for you. I'm, I'm happy it's all worked out. Is there anything you want to show or talk about to the viewers before they go? Um, anything you want to share about the experience? Any message? Like? Yeah, sure. So for me, it was it was uh, although I knew I wanted to be in the states, it was a very open process, mate. It was uh, I was really unknowledgeable. I was going you know off the off the off the cuff a lot of times applying to universities. I just like the look of. Yeah. And um, you know this this really puts the wheels in motion and can help you with. Know, through A to Z in your whole college life and, pl- and you know uh, beyond, uh, no matter what age you are, from 18 or to my age, 24, uh, and no matter what sport, sport that sounds, yeah. it's it's an incredibly easy process, yeah. and uh, hopefully one that can continue for, for a long, long time. So I urge anybody out there to sign up with them if you're looking to go and play college. Hey man, Chris, I appreciate it. Cheers, Chris. Hey, Thanks, mate. I'm going to watch you in in, uh, in America kick some butt, so this is going to be fun. Exactly, too right. Come, come Arizona. Let's do it, man. Thanks, guys. Cheers. Cool.